Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video I will help you familiarizing with the Tableau public interface. So I think it is important to know about the critical components or the general names of the software in which you are working and uh, it really helps us whenever we are communicating with others or asking a questions then to make other people understand we should use the right terms and terminologies uh, to better explain it. So here in this video, we will start with the, this menu bar options that we have. So we have menus like file menu, data menu, worksheet. So this is pretty much the same kind of uh, arrangement which you see in almost any other software. And uh, below to this, you will find different icons, uh, which helps executing an action quickly. Things like adding a new worksheet or adding a new data source. This is what you call a toolbar, similar to uh, any other application that you have seen or software you have seen. So let's move on to this left pane where you have the data and analytics tab. And here in the data tab, you have dimensions and me measure sections. So they basically contain the respective dimensions or measures that you have imported from your data source. Now you don't really have to do anything special to put the dimensions or measures in their respective sections because Tableau is intelligent enough to identify what is a dimension and what is a measure. But if it has not done its intelligent job, then you can actually force moving the field value fields from measure to dimension or dimension to measure according to your requirement. And to do that, you can actually simply drag the field from measure to dimension like I move data. And I can move it back again here in this measure section. So this is a section where you have dimensions and measures listed over here. In the analytics uh, section, you have these different three subsections, summarized, model, and custom. And according to their name, they will perform the similar action. So for example, summarize performs create a box plot kind of a chart, which helps us uh, giving a five number summary which is nothing but uh, uh, five statistics. Uh, so if you have read about statistics, the five number summary is important, in which you have uh, minimum, maximum, first quartile, third quartile, or median. And this box plot helps us uh, giving that information in a graphical way. Apart from this, sometimes information is not enabled or this option is not enabled because the kind of chart or the kind of uh, uh, dimensions or measures we have chosen based on that, the tableau either enable or disabled it so for example totals are not enabled because we have used the line chart and the values are aggregated over the different points of line and there is i think no point in putting a total because we already have this but if we have used the metric or a pivot or things like that or chart like that then uh, then this this option would have been enabled so let's move on from this section to the section which is adjacent to this having different uh, uh, you know these small sections like pages filters and marks so these are basically called cards and shells where you know mark is one of those card where you have uh, uh, different types of uh, these icons representing how you can change the color uh, say size the uh, bar width or align width so cards are nothing but uh, they are containers in which you have the different uh, types of legions or these different types of options and with which you can perform the action. Apart from that, you have shells like uh, column shells or row shells in which you can track the dimensions or measure values and perform the charting and the necessary visualization. On this, uh, on the left, you have uh, pages shelf which helps you split a view based on the number of uh, dimensions or the measure values that you use. Below to that, you have filter shelf in which you can specify the different filters uh, to limit the data according to your requirement. And uh, after this, at the bottom, you have uh, sections like here, we are showing the sheet one. If you want to add new sheet, you can add by hitting the new worksheet option, new dashboard you can create in which you can import multiple sheet and make a good uh, combined visualization. Then you can create a story. Story is we we'll cover in, in upcoming sections. And 
then on the right hand side at the right bottom you have these options where you go from previous sheet to next sheet you can go back and forth and uh, and perform a required operation then you have uh, show sheet sorter to sort the sheets you have film strip you have uh, show tab so these are nothing but a very straightforward things this middle section is nothing but the area where you can uh, perform the visualization do a lot of things with the help of all these different kind of options which is available to you and to perform the visualization here we have the section show me on which if we click it shows us the different visualization that is active and available for us based on the dimensions and matches we have chosen so with the help of this show me section or show me button whatever you call it helps us taking the visualization or choosing the visualization for our requirement so i think that's pretty much all a quick view overview of uh, tableau public interface uh, component i wanted to give it to you and i hope uh, you have found this video useful and i'll meet you in the new video the new topic